This video is not for the sensitive hoes. The ones who can't take anyone else's opinions except for their own. If you can't have a mature conversation, then darling, this video is not for you. You will be blocked immediately. Now remember to keep it cute, keep it mute, or get the boot. Now preparing to nanny port to Nina's raw view. In 3, A2, A1. Abracadabra, I sit on his knee. Presto, change oh, and now he is me. Focus, focus, we take her to bed. Magic is free. We're dead. Josephine Levine presents Magic. A terrifying love story, starring Anthony Hopkins, Anne Margaret, and Burgess Meredith, rated R. Hello guys, it's me, Pierre, aka Nina, Bonina, Banana, Bofana, Osama, Melana, Brown, and we are back again. Right back, right back. I love you, Grandma. Um, doing another freaking raw view. I just saw y'all yesterday and the day before. I'm tired of seeing you. I know y'all tired of seeing me. Girl, I'm so tired of coming to this pig pen and looking at you piggies. I'm sick of y'all. Y'all are stinking up the place. There's so much mud all over here. I'm sick of y'all. Anyway, y'all, we are back for our season, I think episode 14 of season 16 to find out who will be the top four of RuPaul's Drag Race. Uh, well, we know it won't be Morphine. And as y'all say, I call her Mirage all the time. <laughs> so she will not be top four. But, and um, I don't think I have any comments to read because it's, too quick of a turnaround nor tips i'm gonna give it time to accumulate and then the next time but if, if anybody has tipped me since like yesterday day before thank you and i'll read all that and the names and everything come next week but if you would still like the tip all the information is down below in the description box thank you guys in advance make sure you like the video and subscribe and also i was trying to do it solo but somebody been begging me oh my god they've been getting on my knee on their knees but in the wrong way though it's like if you're getting your knees girl suck it okay okay what what whoop, whoop. so we have a special guest special i mean he's a little slow his name hold on let me let me Get there first. His name is Anime. See, okay, story. You know, actually, I'll save that story until he gets there. So let me go ahead and add him on in a second. Hold on. Ladies and gents and all those in between and all of you Mexicans that thought I didn't like y'all. Well, baby, I got my own Mexican over here. And the name is Anime Chan Art. Hello, Anime. Hey, it's so good to be here. I finally want to do this forever. Oh, how are you doing today? I'm doing good. You're doing good? Well, I, you're looking good. I'm liking the Aaliyah bangs going on. Yes, you get, yes. Rocking the Aaliyah. He keeps a swoop bang, y'all. He keeps a swoop bang. Okay, so your name, I think I told you before, it reminded me of, or I thought you were the guy that I used to like watching, Animan. Yeah. <laughs> and the funny thing is, Anime actually, well, what's your real name? I have two names. Okay. Uh, my government name is Rosendo. Okay. And my well-known name is Ross. Rosendo or Ross. Okay, I, I like that. See, your parents, they wanted you to be gay because Rosendo is like, it could be woman, it could be man. So, they knew what they were doing. Do you not like your name? Uh, it's, uh, it's confusing to others. People, like, will say something else. I just go by Ross. By Ross? It's, yeah, it's more easier for them. Right. I can't say my name wrong. Right. Well, I think it's a pretty name. But... He also does, those of y'all that know Anime Man, and y'all know what he draws, he also draws fangs to, oh, you know them fangs. So how did you get into drawing, drawing those fangs? You know those things? Now, oh, I know those things, but do you know those things? How did you start doing oh, I that? I know those things. <laughs> uh, before, I've been drawing those things. Mm -hmm. I've been drawing forever. I'm okay. an artist. I'm a digital artist. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, so since time on, my friend, I have a friend, he introduces me to, um, uh, Not Safe for Work Art, mm -hmm. and when I first saw it, I was like, I can do this too, it's gonna make me, it's gonna make me hard too, but, uh, I've been starting to do that too, because, uh, it's, I don't know, because more attention, more exposure, and I like it. So, know? so if somebody wanted you to commission something for them, how would they go about asking you to commission drawing that thing for them? Um, basically, you can just DM me at both Anime Chun Art and Hentai Chun Art, 
anti John art is my not safe for work account. Well, I will draw not safe for work stuff on that account. So if y'all want to commission me, just DM me. I also I also have the prices and all that information in my pen, so you won't miss it. Cool. So commission me. All right. I need the work. <laughs> <laughs> so have uh, wait. So I see you have a collection in the back. You collect dolls. Is that is that Monster High going on? Yes, well, I'm now collecting Monster High dolls, mm -hmm. and these are the G, the Boo original G1 Monster High dolls. These are the, you know, the first Monster High dolls. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is the camera right? Oh, yeah. I couldn't imagine being a man collect, collecting dolls. That is so lame. Like, it's, it reminds me of this one queen who lost Drag Race. I think her name was, like... Something brown, you know, brown, something, and she collects like Chucky dolls with a loser. So anyway, have you been enjoying this season? <laughs> this season sixteen going on? It's it's just okay, really. It's not a bad season, but it's just a okay season, really. I used to I used to be a big fan of Drag Race. I like the original Drag Race seasons, like season two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then it just got like very repetitive and. And that whole thing where, you know, that whole, like, Mick thing, mm -hmm. I decided to, like, not be a part of, you know, I, I fall off. Right. Because I don't want to be a, yeah. Too much of the negativity makes it un yeah. unfun. Well. And the fakeness. Right, the fakeness. Well, at least mm -hmm. you know. Well, are you ready to get into the show? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. I'm going to do my Jana with here really quick. And the song oh. that I'm going to jam to... Can I do a jamming too? No, bitch. God, that's that, that earlier, earlier. I don't, don't want to edit all day, bitches. <laughs> if it's something, if it's something quick, yes. Oh, you go first. What's the song, bitch? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> all right. Uh, do you know who Aisha Erotica is? No. Super puss. Super puss. Aisha Erotica. Okay. I'm. I'm getting, I don't know, it's, it's giving me, I don't know, wait, wait, so, so what do you like about this song? Uh, it's very great, it's really a bob. So if you did a drag show ever, you would do the song? I would, yeah. There's a, she has a lot of good songs. Is she white? Oh uh, yeah, she is white. Okay, and okay. And she's um, trans. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. So, but, now, so, yeah. Now, so now I definitely have to like it, okay. Uh, that is, <laughs> Stupid freak, and his wife's an idiot. Okay. He's working at a real job, and he's spending all her money. Okay. That's like a read. Okay, so for me, the beat's okay, but I'll be real. For me, it gives me like cliche, like somebody trying to be. I don't know. Like I'm not. It's not like I know what you're saying. Like like I can like see how it could be labeled as a. A unt, like song. you know, song, but like something about it gives me like somebody from Disney doing it, you know, versus like it being like I don't, you know, you know, but but okay. Yeah, it's like hyper pop compared to like pop, just regular pop music. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Here, um, mm -hmm. this is uh, after listening to this song. Does this song make you want to be a slut? No, I can never be one. But you were in that back seat that day. But anyway, <laughs> we are going. To <laughs> so <laughs> my jam is going to be called. This is a pretty much. I guess we're both in the mood for for um, country um, house kind of music. So mine's gonna be "Boy Don't Waste My Time," Baltimore club music. So here we go. Now, yep. She says, "Boy, don't waste my time. Just put your hand or your head in between my thighs." Have you ever had somebody in between your thighs? Yes. <laughs> uh, yes. Uh huh. <laughs> so, so, so you can relate to that on a spiritual level. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and if you ain't trying to eat, then that's a shame. Cause she ain't got time for no games. Put your hand between my thighs and eat it. Y'all, this used to be, they, they used to play this stuff back in the day. Oh, uh, and I go to the club and really like the house floor. When I tell you, we used to go in these beats. Baltimore club music is just off the chain. 
Did you go to the clubs at all or no? Yeah, I went to my first club. It's called South Beach. Mm -hmm. I don't know if any any of y'all know that. Wait, where you live? Houston. Houston, okay. South Beach, Houston, okay. So now there's a guy coming in. He's saying, oh, oh, I have something to say too. He said, girl, don't waste my time. Cause I want a phone tonight. Ow! Don't ask me how my day is. Don't ask me how my dog is. Don't ask me how my mom is. Just put your head in between my thighs. And let have it, honey. Oh. Anyway, that has been Boy Don't Waste My Time, Baltimore Club Music, and that has been jamming with Pierre and Anime. And that's been jamming with Pierre. Now we can get to the show, you dusty hoes. How did you feel about the, the lip sync with Morphine and Safira? Do you think it was judged fairly or do you think it was shenanigans? I have to call shenanigans. I think um, uh, Morphine, I feel like Morphine did better, really. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, Sephira wasn't that bad, but I feel like Morphine gave a little bit more. And right. And Sephira just like, it's kind of a little bit more. I don't know. I, I say, um, um, I say uh, Morphine did more, really. Okay. No, I agree. And actually, a lot of people actually agree with that. But, you know, but I doubt they were going to keep somebody who has zero wins. Versus somebody that had like four wins, you know, regardless. But you, you know, they pick and choose when they want the lip syncs to count and when they shouldn't count, you know. Yeah. When she said sphere, I was expecting her to say Morphe. Same. We all thought that. Because <laughs> she did better than lip sync. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh my God. Did she really mean that congratulations? Because that stink face afterwards, I don't buy it. <laughs> no, <buddy. laughs> are you a, Are you a fan of Nymphia? Be careful, because her fan will throw. What name is that you? That ain't a problem. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not really a big fan of any anybody in the cast. Mm -hmm. I don't have a favorite really. So you're not rooting but for somebody. For somebody. So she is a creative and unique queen. But so like you you have you don't have a certain person who you're rooting for to win. No. Okay. Okay. Cool. Yeah, for the first three people, they hate leotards, but they got to you and they loved it. Wait, did she just clock her for something? You said something about um something about leotards. Oh, about playing Jamie in a leotard, but but they normally hate it. Yeah. <laughs> Once again, pick and choose. Right. Plenty of people with high score for us that have won this competition. Not a lot though. Oh. <laughs> the girls are fighting. Speaking of the four, I don't have as many. Between Plain Jane and Q, who are you going down on anime? Between and Q. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 if you have to do it, who are you going down on? <laughs> I have to choose. Yeah, you have to. Like, 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 if, if you, like, 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 you're. If you don't do it, you die. <laughs> okay, damn. Oh, right now, Q. Oh. Looking at Q right now. Uh -huh. and I'm, I gotta say, Plain Jane. Okay. Uh, well, I thought you would have answered that quicker, like Plain Jane, because everybody seemed to like Plain Jane as a boy, and they think he's hot. So. Yeah. No. Like, um, I don't see it, but. Are you into white guys? Like she, yeah, I am. I don't. I don't care about race. Okay, okay, okay. Y'all heard. Yeah, it. but do I? But mm -hmm. do I think? Do I find her? Do I find her lusting over? No, she just. She just so regular. Just a regular guy, really. Okay. See, but I like that because you know you're not the the like these, like these gays who be all like, oh my god, like oh, do me now, hot, hot, hot. It's like, calm down, goddamn. <laughs> everybody. I know. Oh, no. it's, like I can it's still so weird because I really felt like. This season would never end, and I still can't believe they were actually at top four. <laughs> like I'm like, we're actually at four. Like, did it did it not go slow to you? Really? It, it was it was so long. Mm. Was it when did you when did we start at the the first episode? I don't know. Was it uh, somewhere in January? Was it February? I think. Oh yeah, they, they said the thirteenth of January. So yeah, January. And what is it? April. April. Oh my God! It hasn't been that long for real. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> that is forever for a show to be on. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Uh, now before we leave these hallowed here, halls, I love that suit that RuPaul has. This like black and white, mm -hmm. kind of Two Face Monokuma inspired suit. Mm -hmm. it yeah, is, I love it. It is cute. What do you think? No, it's cute. I think yeah. it's cute. Uh, I I would like to see him in like a more um, slim fit 
suits, like a little more tighter to him a little bit. But it's nice. I mean, it's definitely better than the wigs he he be having on. <laughs> yeah, you'll be lip syncing for your life underwater. Oh, that's cool. So the mini challenge is they have to lip sync for their life underwater. I can't swim. Can you? Uh, I don't swim at all. <laughs> not because I can't swim. I just chose not to. Why though? Well, I would. I would swim, but I would swim by myself. Like if there's like nobody in the pool, nobody around, I would swim. But wait, are if you? There's like a lot of people. Mm -hmm. I would not swim. Are you insecure? I mean, if they ask that about your body or something? Yeah. Oh, stop it! Don't you know that big guys are in? Y'all are in, girl. Us skinny hoes, we're out. <laughs> Y'all are in. <laughs> Y'all are in. The, the real tea is he's scared because he may turn to Ursula. <laughs> wow, look at those jugs. My goodness. And they're waterproof. Well, at least the breastplate will keep them up. A, a flotation device. <laughs> oh, it's I hated that angle so bad. <laughs> I'm going to hate this. I already see. This is so <laughs> stupid, so dangerous, so unnecessary. And my thing is like, are they gonna have to like do it in the same water? Because you know all their spit is going in there too. This it probably will. It's a hole. I'm like looking at this girl. She look crazy. <laughs> I'm sure they're all gonna look crazy. I cannot. <laughs> and RuPaul just cackling. She's like, "Yes, drown for me, queens. Drown for me, queens." I can't. Watch I can't. Yeah, watch a queen die from this. Right, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really mad. They sat down in their office and said, what can we do to torture these girls today? I know. Make them lip sync. And you know, I'm actually going to try that later on in the toilet. Would you try it too? <laughs> no. Uh, no. Not, not in the toilet. Here, don't. <laughs> I mean, you got to be original. You have to be original. <laughs> <laughs> well, who do you who do you think won that right. off off of looking at that? I'm sorry, what? Who do you think won that from doing that? I, I, I don't know. They just all look crazy. I wasn't paying attention to lip syncs. I think um, Safira won because because she right. she she'll be able to laugh at a lot and everything. Yeah. So let's and see. Um, mm -hmm. if you are gonna do that that toilet thing, uh -huh. just be careful. Don't get poop in your mouth. Oh no! Well, well, poop is actually good for your skin. No, it's not, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I am a psychic. She said I have to make up for that lip sync last week. Okay. Well, I got it. Club in Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. Oh, have you been there? No. But you're a Mexican. So how have you not been there? My my ancestors are from Mexico. We just moved to Texas. How are you from Africa, but you live in Detroit? No, <laughs> 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 well, but I have, well, um, I, I I haven't lived in Mexico, but I have traveled to Mississippi and um, Louisiana. That's why you keep ending up on black penis because you're going to the black places of Mississippi and Louisiana. Oh shucks! Okay, I see you, Queen. And write stories about your life. Okay. Okay. Off top, to me, I mean, I'm sure to help you make it interesting. But off top, to me, it seems boring. Like they have to just write a memoir about themselves, like. What are you expecting from this challenge? Like, do, do you think it'll be serious or like spoke, spoken voice or like, what do you think is gonna happen? The queens, I think some of them like, like think of doing something serious, but but the judges, they just want something to laugh at. Right, exactly. So you can, yeah, and, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay, go ahead. No, no, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. And um, there are some queens that can make it funny and some queens that can make it serious. If this was me, it would be really hard because I hate talking about my life really. Mm -hmm. So you would try to go. To, you? you would try to go the serious route. Probably that's what my like. That's what my first. That's what my first thing would, that would come to my head. Mm -hmm. Really. No same. Like 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 that's like even with like really quick that um when we had that fairy tale challenge and you know I had my little sidekick character or whatever you know I was trying to be like more serious about it in a way but then other people were being all goofy and they liked that more. But yeah, you would think that this this would be a more serious thing, you know. But like you're saying. I'm sure they want to laugh and be and be and be acting a fool. So we'll see, we'll see. Cause I, but I would have tried to go the serious route too, though. We're gonna write. How the Someone was saying that they feel like these episodes are wasted because they're gonna have a top four anyway. Do you think they're gonna go with the, having a top four, or do you think they may switch it up and have a top three this time? Uh, it could be anything really, but 
Probably a top four. Okay, probably so. We'll find out in a few. Where I am now, more like a serious tone, I guess, to it. Let's see, he wants to be serious. Yeah. Don't do it, Q. You're setting yourself up for failure. Yeah, and yeah, she's in the bottom for this. Right. <laughs> <laughs> serious? They don't. They just want to laugh. Mm -hmm. They don't care about that. Mm -hmm. Even in, even in, in the lip syncs. Don't be serious. You got this. All right. You're funny. You know. No, secretly, with the amount of stories that I tell y'all all the time, I would have a sickening book. <laughs> My life, you know, the, the things I've been through by Gina Thompson would be a sickening memoir. Stay tuned for it being sold at Payless. I mean, can we get past this or... <laughs> Come on, footage for no reason at all. In front of the camera. So, I feel very confident. What do you think about this outfit? Are you buying, renting it, or what are you doing? I love the shoes. I know I know those shoes. Mm -hmm. You see? Yeah, so I know them. Uh, it's giving me very Power Ranger villain mm -hmm. kind of way. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna rent, I'm not gonna buy or rent the outfit, but I will buy those shoes. Okay. I, I shoes are yeah, I think, I do appreciate it because I'm getting like I'm almost getting like for some reason something like something like that Missy Elliott will wear. The only thing I don't I, th I think I don't like is the hair or maybe like if, if the hair was different or something. But I think I actually will, yeah I, I will rent it. I will rent it, but I will wear it differently though. I want to do okay. this kind of thing where you get the silhouette. Now, Ruben, don't break your hip. Don't break your hip, Ruben. Yeah. <laughs> I'm definitely like a little bit nervous to have this. What do you feel about the South right here? It's getting very. Uh, all times vintage mm -hmm. baby doll dress. Mm -hmm. I would not. I would not buy this or rent this. Yeah. NPA, oh, oh, go no, no, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. Well, it's not about the dress. It's about something else. Um, do you like doing photo shoots? I don't do them. I mean, I haven't really had the chance of like. Do, but like when people were, were reaching out to me, I kind of didn't like want to do it. I don't know. It's too much work. Like, like I, I'm just content being at home, taking a picture in front of my ironing board. You. Uh, if I ever do do drag or be on Drag Race or anything, I would love to. Well, but what, drag, really. But what if it's not drag and somebody just somebody just, just want to shoot you as a boy as yourself? Maybe. You know, I mean, I just yeah, I just I, I just I'm like ugh. But I did do them. You know, I have done a few, but it's I'm not like where I have to do it. Like you know, like you know, these girls they they'll leave the season and then have a photo shoot for each outfit that they wore on on, on the runway. That's so much work for me, but. As far as this outfit goes, I see what you're saying about the vintage, the baby doll thing. The thing that I think messes it up for me, or makes it look boring, is the color. And it's making her look, look like, like a grandma, in a way. So, I think I'll pass on that as well. Cookie Lion, look, I am the queen of the empire, sorry. Okay, I'll go first. It's cute. It's not too much. It's simple, I love it here. I'll rent it. What do you think? Uh, yeah, this is really cute, really. I thought this was like a, some kind of dress a little kind of skirt or something. Mm -hmm. uh, is it a is it a skirt or I think is it it's like a jacket? Just a, like a jacket? Is it just shirt a jacket? Thing? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, uh, but it is cute. I can see like Cardi B wearing it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but the way yeah, yeah. Just, like the way it's flared out looks like a skirt at the bottom though too as well. It could be a skirt yeah. jacket or whatever, but maybe it's too short for her. Both title is plane crash. Yes, um, an expose. Not plane crash. I. The way she's wearing it is maybe 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 he wants to be like, uh, but she's going for this wreck, like she's a wreck of a plain Jane. But if I ignore the wreck part and just look at the outfit as an outfit by itself, I would rent it. How about you? Um, I love the colors. I love the like little like I don't know if it's like pink or white pearl mm -hmm. applicated things around it. And um, I'm just gonna buy. I don't know. I don't really care for this like. Okay. Little, I don't really care for it. Oh. <laughs> so no, I'm not gonna... Y'all but I was picky, honey. Your anime says, girl, I, I'm not buying none of you hoes. <laughs> <laughs> you have the option to put the shoe on. Absolutely. You could look beautiful after a plane crash. Rue, try telling that to people who've actually died in a plane crash or been hurt. I'm sure they don't look beautiful after a plane crash. <laughs> Let's be honest. Connect with the camera. I'm really feeling my, like, nausea. It seems like compared to all the other girls, Rue's really, like, coaching her a lot. Like, it, like, he doesn't really like what she's doing. He's like, do this, do that, do that, do that. So, I feel like she may be in the bottom just from judging this so far, but I don't know. My wig and the scent of my rose and cherry cream while they indulge in me. 
I like how she's trying to give me like <laughs> classy, like a rich woman on a on a boat, but sounds like somebody's uncle from Louisiana. Basking in the wind. <laughs> like this is not making me want to buy the lotion. I'm <laughs> so what do you think on so far of this episode? Are you excited or are you like, oh god? Uh, it's like, uh, <laughs> and this next part uh, they're, they're, oh, oh go ahead, sorry. Yeah. Sorry, go ahead, go ahead. I feel like oh no. I feel like this is gonna be like a kinda like boring episode really. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm not it's not like um I don't know, that mm-hmm. act or that acting challenge when um, Mirage went home or that um girl group challenge. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so Yeah, normally when I it's feel- but yeah, but normally when it's like a top four, top whatever case is, it's a little like, uh, because they, they don't have much to talk about, you know, just like this next part is going to be an interview. I'm like, I'm quite sure I may skip past it, <laughs> honestly. I thought that I was ready for the, the spotlight. Yes. And my friend said... I think he's trying to convince himself to be invested into the story. I think he's doing that thing that starts with act and ends with ing. I think that's what's going on. For the other members of the top four, if you had to be brutally honest in a gift-giving way. Oh, she's already been honest a lot of times. She already said everything to them. There's nothing else to say. I'm doing great. So I'm reading in your book. I hate it. <laughs> the cover. What do, you, what do you think of the cover? Uh, yeah, I hate the cover too, but Zephyrus look. I don't know. She looks like someone I would see on... She looks like a woman, like... Uh, like someone I would see on a daytime TV show, mm-hmm. like her yellow blazer. So cheaters. Yeah, yeah. never mind. He's too young. He 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 don't know what cheaters are. What she, what the show cheaters is. <laughs> never mind. Cheater? Yes, never mind. Little gay boys gravitate towards their grandmothers because I have that too. See, I guess she's being serious, but I can relate to this because I love my grandma and them so bad. I do. Like I like I hope she lives forever you know or until the world ends are you close with your grandparents at all or are they still are they still with us um i'm not close to my mom's parents no okay. hang well i'm close to my grandpa on my mom's side but right my my mom my grandma and my mom they kind of fell out oh but i like my um i like my um grandma because and um everything when um people don't get me and she was like the first person that gave me like a monster high video game oh my mom my dad it was a no right and she she would say yes oh okay well and basically we can all relate to the stories of this okay it's so easy to talk to safira i mean she's such a star yeah i guess i would say safira killed this interview you guys i'm sorry I, uh, I said Safira killed this interview. It seemed like the guy really seemed to be into her. Yeah, and um, I don't know. Like there was a time that I almost was about to be homeless. That's I don't, that's like a kind of fear of mine. Mm-hmm. Same. It, yeah. Yeah. No. I think of mm-hmm. like my mom. Uh, the feels like the only person that cares about me. No, I get it. Trust me, I, that's a fear of mine too. And I and I was kind of in that situation before, in my car and then washing off in a gas station sink. So it, it's in any of us. That's why when people are always kind of like mean to homeless people, um, or like just like make fun of them, whatever the case is. Like we, you know, everybody thinks because somebody's homeless, it's their fault. And oh well, go get a job. You know, as if it's that easy to just to just go get a job. You know, some people are homeless because they choose to be. You know, they don't want to be a part of the whole like government and all that kind of stuff. But some people just really are homeless because life dealt them a bad hand. You know, and they never had a fair chance in the first place. So, you know, whenever I do have something and I feel like it, I do give it to, give it give it to them. I wish I can give more because I feel like you know, what is five dollars or a dollar going to do? You know, but but then you know, and, and then you think, well, if I give them this money, are they actually going to spend it on what they should, or are they going to buy? You know, you think they're going to buy drugs or whatever the case is. But at that point, it's not your problem anymore as long as you gave from your heart whatever they do with it is on them but yeah you know any of us could be homeless at any time at any second you know we're like, like so, some of us are one paycheck away from being homeless you know whether we know it or not so savor every bite oh, I'm guessing yes. that's- i hate the book cover <laughs> it looks i don't know it looks very like i don't know very kiddie-ish very mm-hmm. elementary right because i would yeah you're right i would think it was like a kid's book too or something <laughs> Yeah, and I don't know, what do you think of um, uh, Q's makeup? Yeah, no, I think we had the same thought, but I was like, oh, I ain't gonna say anything, but I was thinking like she looks kind of old here or something. 
Like I've seen her look better. <laughs> is that, I, was, is, um, I was thinking of <laughs> not, not Cindy Lou. Yeah, no read, but it's like <laughs> I don't know if I like the makeup or anything. Yeah, yeah, no, no, I agree with you. It's it's something a little a little off putting here with the face on here. So yeah, no, I agree. Like around Christmas time because my mom, I can always tell my mom got like it a. Can you relate to that at all? Like as far as like holidays and your parents and them couldn't get you what you want, what they wanted to get, and and or being less unfortunate. I didn't really pay attention to that. Like, I, I was just like, oh, man, give, give me something for Christmas, even though it's like one or two presents. I'm, d I'm definitely fine with it. Okay. Oh, you was a good child. Oh, yeah. Because I wasn't, I wasn't a girl. I, I used to have me a big old list, and I had the most crazy things. I had, I said, I wanted a leprechaun. I wanted a leprechaun. I wanted magic dust. I wanted... What the fuck you want a leprechaun for? <laughs> so that way I can get more more gifts. I can make more wishes for gifts. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta think smart about it. Hello, like, give me a leprechaun. Give me magic dust. <laughs> give me wishes. <laughs> give me wishes. <laughs> so that I can make more gifts. Make more things coming out. Exactly. But, but, it's like, but, but, like, but like, when you're younger, you know, well, I believe in Santa Claus, you know, and I still try to just just for the fun of it. But you know, but like, but like when you're younger, you don't think about those things about your parents because you're thinking that you know it comes from Santa or, but you don't think like oh how hard it was for them to try to get you the thing that you did want. But now, but but then when you get older, you're like oh it really is tough out there. I understand. So yeah, I can relate to that. How are you? I'm doing great. Wait, can we hold our breath? She's not wearing yellow anime. She's not wearing yellow. Can you believe it? Oh my, I don't believe it. I think she's serious about her book. Breaking like wind, the art of letting go. I think you're so funny. Are you loving her top, her her cover? Yeah, I like the cover. I like I like the look now because she had she got rid of that yellow thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's giving me very um. I love the look. It's giving me very like DLCs, no scrub, the music uh -huh, video. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. I, I can see that. No, I yeah. like the pose and the statue, but I feel like. It's a bad job on the editor's side, as far as like this plain white background and there's just like nothing going on at all. Like I feel like, I feel like they could have added a little more to it, but besides, but her though, yeah, she, she, she did good. You know, growing up seeing a white man, high features, a tall nose. But what about a black man or a Mexican man? Why is it always a white man? I could really change up how I look, right. and I can escape my face. That just hit me. It hit me. I'm like, escaping your face. Hmm. That was deep. I think I may buy her book. And by buy her book. I buy her book too. Yeah, and by buy her book, I mean, I want everybody to tip me now so I can buy it. Um, dare I say, for some weird reason, I actually like the wig. <laughs> of course, you know, the hairline could be a hairline. But I think it looks like kind of classy. And I actually like it. And the dress isn't bad. I actually will. I think I'll actually buy this look for her. What do you think? Um, is that like a, what's a, is that like a color? I don't know. For some reason, I thought it was like a brown, kind of beige colors in that dress, but, mm -hmm. um, it's giving mermaid. The dress is giving very mermaid. Um, I don't really care for it. I'm not gonna buy a rented. Nope. Oh. <laughs> the hair, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not gonna buy a rented. Well. <laughs> Yeah. And that's because I could judge a book. Yeah, she looks good here. Michelle looks good. And I love her hair. I love her hair. Oh, yeah. She always looked good uh, these days. Yeah. I think she got, I know she had, she, had, she had a tattoo there the whole time. I did. Oh, so you looking at her breasts? Are you straight? Too good. <laughs> I'm just reveling. So in my mind, in my mind, in my mind, they were inspired by my fan head look. I, in my mind, so let me have that moment. Don't don't don't, don't take it from me. But my my fan and her look, they made them want to do a fan look. I said what I said. I said what I said, and I would have freaking killed this fan look. But as far as this outfit goes, I know it just showed it, but I can see it enough. I'll buy it. I'll buy um, it. she looks like an orange Tinkerbell. Do you see it? Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, yeah. It's giving very orange Tinkerbell. Very, you know, fairy. Um, orange ballerina. Um, but personally, I would I would not wear this. So I'll maybe maybe a maybe a rent a oh. rent one time. Okay, cool. I'm giving you African fabrics, and then boom. I hmm. Mm -hmm. You you go first. You go first. Um. Wait. Is the theme fans? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, oh. Okay. Um. 
the dress. Oh no, minus the the fan right, popping out of her dress. Mm-hmm. I was kind of kind of bored. Right. Her hair looks nice, so I'm just gonna. I'll I'll buy the hair, but I'm not buying or renting the dress. Yeah, so when she was walking, I'm like, the cover-up was giving me nothing. Um, But then when the thing came out, it was like, oh, cool. Like, the cool part wasn't coming out right. But but what makes me not like it all the way is like, where's the shape? There's no shape in the body. There's no... It almost just seems like that thing is behind her. It's just just there. It doesn't seem like it's like a part of the outfit. I just... Yeah, I... Yeah, I feel like it could have been more going on with the dress itself in the middle. It's just this basic, boring fabric. But the idea, the concept was nice, but I don't think it was hit all the way. I'm going to put it on layaway and have the person come back in and work on it some, and then I'll make it back and rent it. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah. Let's make cake. This is an Asian version of... She said this is an Asian version of Marie Antoinette, but it looks the same as the, as the, as the British. I don't... I don't... Yeah, to see any Asian S to this look because it's very European. Right, yeah. Um, For Nymphia, this could have. I, you know, you expect more from Nymphia, but I'm like, this was, this is kind of just like this. This is your look for fans. Like this, is, where's the fan? Is it, is it because you're gonna have a, a fan in your hand or like what's where's the fan? I'm going to pass on this. I'm not gonna buy a rent it. Yeah. Go ahead. And um, uh, yeah. I don't, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna buy a rent it, but yeah, I said that there's other girls that done this look and done it way better. Mm-hmm. And I like um, her boy in blue look better than this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that's it. Oh, okay. A period dress with a- If you're wearing a period dress, wear the tampons and wear the blood. Make it make sense. Quickly floating down this runway as if I'm just- dis- I'm giving, it's giving very Greek, mm-hmm. kind of Egypt kind of look. Um, very goddess. Uh, I like the, I like the, but, the top. But are you getting fan? No, I'm not getting fan at all. Right. <laughs> As I'm saying, I'm like, well, 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 you gonna, you gonna rent it at least or no? I'll rent it. It's not a bad look, but it's not giving, I don't see fans about it. Right. So that's my point too. It's like, okay, yeah, yeah, it's not a bad look. It is giving, you know, Greek. Yeah, it is giving that. I agree. If this was another runway, then fine. But if the main focus is fan, the fan is not the isn't, isn't the focus at all, literally at all. So for that reason, I'm going to pass on it because no. When I tell you my fan head look would have killed this runway, when I tell you I would have slayed these girls into a coma, girl, I cannot. Uh uh-uh. uh, no. It is. I would have probably chosen something else. He was such a girl. Cool- be like Rue, you don't want that to the photos. <laughs> you did. It. You're there in that Missy Elliott squad. That's Lil' Kim. <laughs> right, exactly. Because that's very Lil' Kim. And that yeah. um, and that poster where she has on um, the leopard bikini. Hard, and, hardcore? Yeah, uh-huh. And she's all squatting and plotting. She, yeah. said, she said, white boy, hush. Obviously, the fan nails. Um, to be- See, I didn't even notice the dang, that her nails her nails had fans on the nails. So, like... I did. Oh, you did? Oh, well, I didn't notice it. So, uh-huh. a little too late, I guess. Squirrely with trying to get a straight answer out of you. Well, you'll never get a straight answer because she's gay. RuPaul, use your brain. Use your brain, honey. Congratulations. You are the winner of this week's... I don't buy it. I don't. Sorry. Yeah. Right. The reason, the reason I, I don't, I kind of feel like this was just their way of trying to get her into the finale. Just because. Like, because, like, I really feel like... And, 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 no, don't get me wrong. Like I said, when she said that thing about... Escaping her face, I felt it all the way. It was really powerful. And so I don't think, I don't think she had a bad um, interview at all. But it felt like it was actually going to go to Safira. But they didn't want to give her another win for whatever reason. And they just wanted to make sure that they put her into the the top. Um, What's her name? Nymphia. So maybe they want to have the Asian winner finally. I don't know. But I doubt she's going to win. But what do you think? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Who do you think is going to be in the bottom? I, well, I told you who I think would be the bottom. It's, it's me, Plain Jane, because they wasn't really feeling her, it seemed like. And Q. Plain and Q. Yeah, Sam. Yeah. Yeah. Either, either those two, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. For some reason, I'm not trying to be funny, and this is not even, but I, it, doesn't, it, almost, it almost doesn't feel deserved. 
Like, like I'm, I'm trying to think of the whole season. I'm like, out of people who they sent home, because let's the, the, the be honest, they kind of saved her about two times from from lip syncing for her life. Honestly, when she should, when she should have a couple of times. I don't know. Something about it just, just doesn't seem like right. I don't know. Like, yes, yeah, she's had some good fashions, stuff like that, and she is. You know, she's she's an interesting character on the show, but yeah, I don't know. Y'all y'all have to let, let me know what, what y'all think down below. Plain Jane, I'm sorry, my dears, but you were both. Well, call me a psychic, Q, and Plain oh, Jane. Hi. I mean, you kind of got it after I said it, but you could be second-handed psychic. <laughs> <laughs> do you do you know the song? No. Same. <laughs> and how it sounds? Uh, uh huh. Okay. Q is doing, I mean, not Q, um, Plain Jane is doing good so far with that, with the fur, I don't know, with the lip singing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, I don't know if I, I don't know if I'm feeling this song so far, but let, let me see. Don't I don't like the face that Q's making. Like, I think she's trying to be, like, this serious, like, singer, but I, I don't like the face she's making. I feel like, I, I feel like Plain is trying to give, like, I mean, I don't know. It's kind of boring, honestly, on, on both ends. But, but I, I don't know. Yes, I know. <laughs> yeah, plain Jane one. <laughs> that just confirmed it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Shantae Houston. Well, do you agree? I mean, they're not bad, but they're not good either. Right. Um, yeah. <laughs> Right, it's like, yeah, I guess if I have to choose out of the two, she, I guess she won, you know. But it was, yeah. But it was like, okay, <laughs> yeah, I, I, I didn't care for that song or lip sync ruling. Really. Yeah. It, it is what it is. Sashay away. Well, there's the top three. I, I see. I really feel like it should be Q Bear and Nymphia shouldn't be there. <laughs> if I like, like between those two, maybe they wanted to make it more diverse. I don't know, you know, but I'm just like, I it just seems a little, a little weird to me. But okay, all right. Love you guys so so much, and I know you guys pretty. Okay, so that was a long episode. It really was. I'm like, why is it so long with only four girls? Like, why? But overall, what do you think of this episode, anime? Do you agree with the outcome? Um, uh, it could both can in both either ways, but yeah, I think um, Plain Jane deserved her spot for the episode. I was it was kind of it was kind of boring. It was kind of a boring episode. Mm -hmm. Real. Uh, well, who do you think who do you think is going to win now out of this top three? It could be it could be either way. Really, I really don't know. Um, it could be Sephira, Nymphia, or Plain Jane, really, really don't know. I feel like it'd be between Nymphia, I'm sorry, between Jane or Sephira. You know, unless the fans are just being, playing favoritism with Nymphia, but it definitely should be one of those two that, that should win as far as, like, if they're, if they're, if they're going to win. Well, that has been the season 16 episode 14 raw view we now have a top three with nymphia safira and jane and for real congrats to nymphia being there i just have my different opinion about how it how it how it happened but yeah thank you anime for doing this raw view of me you're welcome and i'm so glad to be part of this raw view thank you no, no seriously thank you for, for for wanting to do it um, it, it can be a little tough doing it, but but thank you. And now you can always have this memory of you being in the canceled queen's video. Hey. <laughs> and actually be prepared to be canceled too. <laughs> well, <I don't> care. <laughs> if you guys did like anime, and once again, he did give his information out um, in the beginning. Give it again. Where can they find you at? You can find me at Anime Chun Art at all social platforms on Instagram, Twitter, I mean X, mm -hmm. or Blue Sky. And you, and you can also find me at another account called Hentai Chun Art on on Twitter and Blue Sky as well. So if you want to, if you want a commission from me, DM me. Right. I really need the work. Money, honey, trust. Trust. Like, and if y'all are freaky out there and need y'all's dang dang drawn, he'll do it for you. So anyway, thank y'all for watching this raw view. And remember to stay, Eat, to stay, stay beautiful. But most importantly, stay then, then slow down. 
<laughs> but most importantly, stay blessed. Ow. Kima Cho or Kamochi. Ta ta. That's all, folks. And. <laughs>